760 horsepower, 625 pound-feet of torque, and zero to 60 in 3.5 seconds. That's really all the technical specs you're gonna hear from me today on our latest 2020 Shelby GT500. We wanna get rid of all that stuff. You know about the power uh, and how phenomenal of a car this is. Today, I just wanna show you guys how beautiful it is and how awesome it sounds. Let's go. You know, it's arguable that the white Mustang has the biggest following with the white Mustang registry and just so many notorious groups out there for white Mustangs and Chevys of all kind. Just a beautiful, phenomenal package here. I really love the stripes, guys. So without the stripes, it just wouldn't look as near as aggressive. So these are actual painted dual over the top racing stripes. Uh, no lines, no issues there. A true painted accessory option uh, from Ford performance just gotta love it look at this front end oh just so mean and aggressive so much uh, room for air to come into the front end all designed by four performance but just a gnarly aggressive mean front end by far my favorite shelby of all time the gt500 so we're 5.2 liters uh supercharged of course it's got a very good balance i feel like that 13 and 14 gt500 was very heavy you could feel it on the front end a lot it was just a very heavy front end car to where you know it had 662 horsepower but it was just heavy and it felt and drove heavy and this car does not um, so just a more balanced car in general now as far as window sticker options guys we've got uh, the carbon fiber track pack it's 18.5 it's your carbon fiber wheels uh, the wing inner inner workings and Recaro seats on the inside, the painted stripe, a big hefty 10 grand sticker there, and 315s and 305s on the tire size, and you've got 20 inch wheels. So the carbon fiber, and it's real carbon fiber. Gotta love that. Uh, typically, you know, they do a 19 on a, a high performance car, but I like they went with the 20. So the 20 just looks great overall and still has those great handling and ride quality characteristics that you would look for in a uh, trackable. Uh, performance car. Gotta love your six piston Brembo's up front in the red and also the carbon fiber exposed wing on the back too. Looks great. Please do not damage that guys. It'll, it'll cost a hefty penny to replace either that wheel or that spoiler. Quad tip exhaust sounds killer. Without further ado, let's hear it. Trust me, the amount of power, and this, this is just more a well-rounded vehicle 
with the automatic transmission. I feel like it's more manageable, more controllable, and I think I know it's faster for sure. On the track or uh, at the drag strip, this car is faster uh, in the automatic. Now you can paddle shift, and that can be argued which one's faster for that, but shifting in and under one one hundredth of a second is just totally impressive. And um, I'm, I'm sold on it. The 10 speed is legit. The six speed in previous generations, I haven't been a fan of. The 10 speed gets a thumbs up from Real Deal. So now our RPMs have come down now that the engine's gotten warmer. It's just purring nicely now. sounds just even more phenomenal going down the road under load. That's where the magic is. That's when it sounds even better, guys. Let's check out under the hood and wrap this up. So you've got double pins to push in on each side, which releases the hood use standard way. has a nice power strut brace you see above there too added support carbon fiber composite materials it's a beauty so guys nothing fancy or too technical just wanted to show you another beautiful gt500 i think this is our fifth one we've received so far more on the way we are your source for anything auto high performance off-road all of your accessory needs one store, Aikens Ford Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram, Why with his custom accessories in Liner, Georgia, guys. Thanks so much.